We are about to bear witness to the queen. Listen, here is a truly generational talent. There's no doubt about that. The following is an Extreme Rules match. Making our way to the ring from the Queen City, the SmackDown Women's Champion, Charlotte Flair. The personification of majestic elegance, a fearless defender of her crown. She says everyone will bow down to her. There's no question Charlotte is WWE royalty, but Charlotte often lacks compassion for those around her. Well, that comes with the territory when you've been superior most of your life. Right. Flair says she's proud to be a queen, and she should be celebrated. Well, Flair will also embarrass and humiliate those who choose not to fall in line. Now you can't deny the greatness of Charlotte Flair. She always finds a way to handle her business. And she shows why she's the most ruthless and dominant woman in sports entertainment history. Always guaranteed to have a vicious plan of attack. Most are playing checkers while the queen is a grand master at chess. The Beast is here. Time for a beatdown, cowboy style. And his opponent, from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock Lesnar. When you look at Brock Lesnar, you, you honestly got to feel that Lesnar is more beast than man. Now, Lesnar is undoubtedly the next step in human evolution. He has unbelievable physical gifts, does the beast. Facing perhaps the greatest competitor in women's division history, beating Charlotte will make you a legend. That's a true statement, but it's only true because of how difficult, borderline impossible it is to achieve this task. Those sticks, garbage cans, chairs, ladders, throw in the kitchen. Good luck getting out of this. I guess that's one way to do it. Impressive reversal there. <laughs> Continuing to attack the neck. Draped over the top rope. Their breath out. Effective counter. <laughs> oh, that's gonna sting. Corey, a false counter to a match can turn an entire arena upside down. How can a superstar put themselves in a position to win? A competitor must put themselves in a position of power, a position of control. Render your opponent immobile and continue the assault. It's all about making use of your surroundings. You can't take anything in the environment for granted. Lesnar cuts him off. Work the mop. And a suplex. Cover, cover. Kick it out. Close to three. Close call. That was almost lights out. He leaves the ring, and there's no countouts in this one. And now he may be planning to turn this match into his very own 
Home Run Derby. Uh oh. Clearing the table. Yeah, you're gonna take it to the next level. What is this superstar thinking? They're thinking about the end. Finishing this thing off by any means necessary. Good God, that's devastating. Lots of potential for injury here at ringside. These superstars better be careful. The floor, the barricades, our table. None of these things are fun to collide with. Flair moved at the right time. Eat defeat. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Uh-oh, Dragon Sleeper applying. This could be it. This is not a familiar position. Oh, his will is getting tested here. Firing up those shots, not having much effect. And this time, it works. Oh, and a knee. Hit another. One after the other. Guys, they are getting way too close for comfort here. Yeah, I've seen this before, and it doesn't end well. Charlotte Flair with a trademark chopping. Oh, natural selection by Charlotte. Can that finish the beast off? As everyone else, Cole, his opponent included. And Charlotte will have to go back to the drawing board and try and get things back where she wants them. And now gets tossed into the ring. Got the leg and drops the elbow. means she has the whole outside to play with. And she finds an answer to Charlotte. Oh, he's got him up high. The fallaway slam. Able to reverse. Ooh, look at her answering back. He's in a little bit of trouble now. That's the sort of merciless attack we've come to expect from Charlotte. Hoisting their opponent. Oh, Fisherman Buster. Cover. Catch out before the two count. This match continues on. Brace for impact. Here it comes. The Beast Incarnate with him. Reigns down an elbow in retaliation. Overhand connects. Carefully measured knee strikes. Still that oh, again. Yikes. Flair is falling behind now. Charlotte needs to find a way to reverse her fortunes. Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's got to hurt. Just cranking the head. Lesnar unleashed. We are beginning to reach a point of desperation in this match. These athletes' bodies can only take them so far. You have to imagine they're reaching their breaking point. She's taking things to ringside, and he gets delivered back into the ring. Planted with a wicked DDT. Great counter. Trapped now and just an oh, elbow to the face. Taking it outside the ring now. All right, she's back in, ready to go. Knee right to the gut. Down the open and a double axe handle smash. Can't quite get him there. Every maneuver being returned with counter fire. Oh, he got him. Is he gonna lock this in? In. This will tear your knee apart. Trapped and nowhere to go. Except for maybe the emergency. Trying to reverse, trying to break out, firing out shots, and does so successfully. Uh 
Oh, here it comes! Brock Lesnar! Strength to kick out of that one. Lesnar can't believe it, and honestly, I don't know if anyone here can. Under any other circumstances, that would be it. It would be over. Oh, look at the knees. Burying knees into the body. Oh, he is trapped now in just a sharp elbow. And that's going to impair Brock even more. The Queen is looking for a chance to deliver a knockout blow. Lesnar with a well-timed shot. Boom! Getting carried. Unsure what they're thinking. Are you kidding me? That's another focused attack to her torso area. He may get the three count right here. Is it? It's all over. Brock Lesnar comes up big with a win. Here is your winner.